you know, you know sometimes you might, anyway, let me explain. Yeah, I like you, but we like you, me. Cause you're not for me, you sent to me, like a text. I don't like to see you around guys, cause it makes me vex. Listen to my context, we don't have to get straight to this. We just hit and talk, the place in the bed. Baby, you sent to me, you get wet, we just met. And already I'm falling for you, is it meant to be? Cause if it turns out like fate, then you're ready to meant to be. I like the way that you move, it's your front and back, that's so smooth. You've got me so, so seductive, and I don't know which hand to Yeah, I'm okay. Are you ready to laugh? Yeah. Alright, this next guy coming to the stage is someone that I started my journey as a comic with. He just he looks just like me, and trust me, he's a killer. He's been killing it up and down the country. He even won the title as best newcomer to urban comedy, which I was kind of hating on still. But still, give me a number one. Give me a number two. I make some noise for my brother, from another mother, the one they call Kevin J J J J J. What? Give up a little man. Give up a little man. Alright, you obviously doing that well. <laughs> How's everyone doing? Everyone okay? I'm probably like the first act you have seen tonight, isn't it? Oh, sorry, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad, that's bad. <laughs> it's good to be in East... <laughs> sorry. It's good to be in East London. Who's from East London? Make some noise. <laughs> Any white people in here tonight? Yeah. Can, can I leave with you? <laughs> can, we, can, we, can we leave together? Yeah. It wasn't a conversation. <laughs> this guy's trying to relate to me. Are we related? <laughs> um, I've been going all around the world. I got a phone call to do comedy in Nigeria. I got a phone call. Can you come to Nigeria and do stand-up comedy? Me! I was so scared, you know. Is there any Nigerians in the house tonight? Any Nigerians? Yeah. Okay, are you allowed to be here? <laughs> <laughs> Just ask him. <laughs> Just ask him. <laughs> Just ask him. <laughs> Nigeria is a beautiful place, man. If you haven't been to Nigeria, you must go. You must go to Nigeria. Um, I, I, there's, there's this thing called Black People's Time. Black people's time. I'm not going to judge whether there's such thing as black people's time. It's not for me to do. But what I will judge is Nigerian time. Nigerian time. My flight was supposed to take off at 12 noon. 12 noon. I'm white. I got there at 8 a.m. <laughs> just in case. I got on the flight at 12 noon. Came. It was just me sitting there. Even the passengers hadn't arrived. Just me. 1 p.m. came. The passengers arrived. 2 p.m. came. They started getting restless. 3 p.m. came. The pilot came on the time like... Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome aboard these flights to. Where are we going? <laughs> Welcome aboard these flights to Lagos. Please make yourselves comfortable. We are going to be taking off when I'm ready. Hey, it's Kevin J. I want to tell you my highlight of tonight. Other than all the beautiful girls in the crowd, it was getting paid. It's always nice when a promoter puts money in your wallet and says what he was going to do. If these guys try and book you for a show, do it because they pay. They're not like the rest. Peace! Black girls think white guys eat pussy like Pac-Man. <laughs> and we do, but that's beside the point. <laughs> Before I go, I just want to say, like, little man touched on it. I've been doing comedy three years. Last year, I won Best Newcomer at the Black Tie Comedy Awards. Thank you, thank you. 
And like, it's just, it's, for me, it's like, I grew up in the area, predominantly African and Caribbean, so when I decided to do stand-up comedy, this is the kind of place that I thought I should come and tell jokes. I just want to say thank you so much for allowing me to come on your circuit and showcase my talent. I truly appreciate it. Honestly, thank you. Thank you. What's going on, people? This is Kevin J, the comedian, and I've just performed at You're Having a Laugh here at the Vibe Bar. Shout out to everyone that was in the audience tonight. Wicked show. Make sure whenever you hear that these guys are in town or they're putting on a show, you come down and check it out. I'm Kevin J. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, at Kevin J Comedian. My website, ilovecomedy.com. I've got 99 problems, but a joke ain't one. It's a debut for the LCM family. I'm gonna put my boys on stage. Kilo, Mello, see it. Ready for the heavyweight. We're ready for the heavyweight. All right. We're about to bring one of the UK stand up champions. He won Best Male Comic. He's someone I watched as a young man and thought, yeah, this looks like a decent job. He's the baddest man in the business at the moment. Ladies and gentlemen, stamp your feet. Clap your hands. And make some noise for one of the bad boys. The one they call Slim, 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 Slim. Big man, thank you very much. Thank you very much. How's everyone doing? You know, right? Yeah. Lovely, lovely. I've got to say first, watch out for the short women then in here. Some of them in here shut us. Yeah. You know, I came around this way here to stand up, prepare for the stage. You know, the shortest one out of the group, just in my back. What? Can't see. I can't see. Move out the way. And to be a bit better than that, man. Say sorry now. There you go. Sheepish. I'd say to her, I'm on net. I'm gonna fuck you up when I go up. There you go. So you have to mind when you're poking in the back like that. Then it broke my spine. Wow, well, man. How's, it, how, how's everyone enjoying the year so far? Is the year been going all right? It's, it's still a bit early. It's still a bit early. I've been going on good. I had my one man show. Who came down to the one man? Yeah? Few of you. Welcome to the rest of you, bastards. <laughs> Yo, I'm Slim the Comedian. I'm here tonight at JMC's One Night Stand, and I'm here to have a laugh. The ending of 2009, October to be precise. Yeah, because you know what happened? I hurt myself and I had to go for an operation. Oh, you look like, well, how you hurt yourself, Slim? I'm going to tell you, this is really for the guys. I'm going to tell you, I'm all right now. Yeah? I broke my hood. Oh. No, she said, what did he say? What, what did he say? My hood, cock, dick. You know, huh? 
You don't know what that means. I broke it. Everyone's like, how can it, why did you break it? Can you break it? The girls are like, I don't know if it could break. I pop it. I pop it. I swear to you, I ain't gonna lie, it's six back out. I swing it now, it's cold. But at the time, I popped it, man. Greedy, went back from a show. At the time, the girl I see, that's how we do, you know, go and get a little drink tonight. I ain't letting you look see me drunk. Fuck that. Next thing, look at slim. You know what I mean? So I drink when I go home. I'll have a drink and a little smoke. And yeah, nice, ready for that. And we started to get into it. And up, you see me, I'm a man. I like to make sure, if I'm with a girl like that, I like to make sure the get ladies enjoy themselves. I do. Because some guys don't give a fuck, you know, girls. I've heard it. Man said, I don't care, I don't care. It's not like that. Not like that. Make sure she enjoy herself. Then I said, it's my turn. And guys, you know, it's when we're ready to come, we can go a ragamuffin sometimes, innit? Be cheerful, especially with the frosting, you know what I mean? So this is how it happened, yeah? I'm in, so for sex, you know? So for sex, this is. So I decided it's time for me to come. So I throw up the legs then, bro, proper, on the shoulder, and I use, remember the arms? That like, yeah, the arms are usually on the sofa. I use that as push-off, leverage. You know what I'm talking Fuck that, yeah! I need my arm up like myself. And I throw some hood on it. Now what happened is... You know what happened? Guys, we're all big people in here. We always have sex, right? Guys, you know this. You put your butt in and you pull it out just a bit too much. Yeah? And you don't have to push it back in. Now usually you women suffer for that move. You do. Guys, how much time have you been fucking there? Pull it out too much. And you push it back and it link them between the pom pom and the ass piece. And your skin. And then, oh, your blood clots. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, man. And my highlight tonight was when I was talking about my operation. Crowd loved it. I'll tell you something, though. The first time I had sex once, they took that shit off. <laughs> I don't know how, how you, some of you girls like it, but I tell you, it was sensual. I did this rag up. No, fuck that. It was hard. This here is how does that feel. You're joking. You think I was going to ram, ram, and hear snap again? Fuck no. So I'm warning you guys, yeah? Especially them girls there. Because the doctor, oh, the doctor, everything. He says, usually it's the woman that snaps it. I said, well, well, how? He says, the woman likes to be on top. The ones that are ragamuffin. You know, you, you know if you're the woman that like that. Guys, you know that woman that'll hold your neck up and go, yeah, 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 yeah. That don't like devil. Them bitches will break your cock. <laughs> they will. <laughs> People always say that, oh, I can't believe that slim. I'm telling you. My dad laughed. You tell a black daddy break your cock, you know, they find it humorous. Because he was abroad, so when he come back and come to visit me and see me laying down there, what wrong with you? I brought my hood. Eh? I brought my hood. <laughs> Thanks for the concern, Dad. Listen, you've been a nice crowd as always. Enjoy the rest of the night, yeah? And guys, mind your cocks. My name's Slim. Peace. Last name ever. Like a sprained ankle, boy, I ain't no flavor. Started off local, but thanks to all the haters, I know G4 pilots on a first name basis. Where you say this? Did you enjoy that, people? Man, them, you cool? You take heed in what you said? From now on, just pure slow sex for me. Right, I've just finished on stage. Wicked show as usual. Big it up, JMC in the place and the one night stand. Um, how I felt, um, the crowd was wicked, the jokes went well, and myself, Kevin J, and Little Man done our thing. I'm your host, follow me on Twitter, Lee Little Man, ladies, favourite. You understand? You've been a wicked audience, please come to the next show, put your name down on the mailing list, and have a nice night, drive safe people, you done now. Hello, and Slim was excellent, Thanks. and all the comedians really made me laugh, the singers were brilliant, and what a lovely night, I'm glad they came out. Oh, Hi. and a kiss as well. <laughs> Big up all the acts you saw tonight, you had Mo the Comedian, you had Dion Reed, you had 
Naylor Boss, you had Slim, you had Kevin J. It was an amazing show. I can't even lie, I was proper laughing. I had to bring out the big jokes tonight. But big up um, St. Francis Hospice, that's the charity we're working for. It was an amazing night. Just make sure you're at the next show. I'm flustered right now.